Yeah, good afternoon. Going to be watching this quarter of Manchester today. Just down the other end of the Warwick Road, they're preparing for the One Love Manchester tribute concert later this evening. First, though, 65,000 plus inside Old Trafford to pay homage to one of Manchester United's modern greats, Michael Carrick, who's put together the all conquering United vintage of 2008, led by Sir Alex, who are going to take on a team made of some of the great players that Carrick has faced down the years. You will notice that somebody is missing from the lineup, and that is the man himself, Michael Carrick, who is going to emerge in a moment from the centre tunnel. And the two teams lining up alongside all of the trophies that Michael Carrick has won in his quite extraordinary Manchester United career. Such a big day for the Carrick family. They're here in force. His parents, his kids are going to be walking out with him as well. They're going to be part of the mascot. There's his brother, <laughs> Graham, who's on the bench younger brother who hopefully will get an opportunity in the game at some point so it's just a fantastic day for the Carrick family wonderful for him to see his former teammates some of his current teammates as well but his former teammates from the 2008 side and some of the great players that he's faced down the years Wayne Rooney you must feel like a spring chicken today he's the youngest man involved Wayne Rooney at the age of 31 and now we wait for oh, Michael Carrick to emerge from the, the centre today time. Today is about a true Manchester United player. Served the club with dedication, commitment and passion. Old Trafford, please acknowledge and put your hands together for Michael Carrick! <laughs> Wonderful for Michael and his kids, Louise and JC who are coming out onto the field and he's going to say a few words to the huge crowd here a wonderful mosaic as well that is there in the Sir Alex Ferguson stand directly opposite us it looks absolutely wonderful you must feel so proud Michael Michael so much organization goes into this day he's going to speak to the uh, crowd now the fans think. The turnout you've had today, the mosaic looks absolutely fantastic. Keep it held up there, it looks absolutely brilliant. You must be delighted. Yeah, I, I, can't, I can't speak highly enough. I mean, when, when we first thought about putting this game on, um, you know, I was, it's a bit daunting, to be honest. I think I hope someone turns up, you know, but the, this, you know, I couldn't expect anything like this. So um, thank you so much for turning up. It's, it's amazing and it looks fantastic. Two very special managers involved today for Michael Carrick. Inter now, Old Trafford is a special occasion here today. Lots of players have turned out for Michael football. Carrick, and of course, he's going to acknowledge that. Thank you, Michael. Yeah, f first of all, I'd like to say, um, you know, this this game's now got extra significance in, in the wake of what's happened over the last couple of weeks. Um, it's been a tough time, and I'd just like to to welcome. The families of, of, of some of the victims from last week um, on, on my behalf. I'd like to extend my condolences and my thoughts to those affected in Manchester, but obviously in London last night as well. And um, again, all our thoughts and prayers go out to those that have been affected and we will stay together and stay strong. I'd also like to welcome here today, um, there's about 300 of the emergency services who were heroic um, in their efforts o over the last couple of weeks. They're here today, so please show your appreciation for them.
I'd like to say a quick few thank yous to myself. I, uh, to myself? I don't want to thank myself. <laughs> I've got a few thank yous to make to um, a few people. Um, first of all, the, the testimonial committee, Joe, Dom, Dave. Amazing job to put this on. Um, we, we, we made it, you know, it's been a long few months, but we've made it. Um, moving on from that, my friends, my family, they were sit, all sitting up there. It's incredible to, to see you all here. My, my parents, my mum and dad, have been inspirational for me from, from obviously day one. I love you loads. I'd also like to, my, I'd also um, like to thank my brother. He's made the team. I didn't pick him, but he's made the team, so he's going to come on second half. And of course, of course, I'd like to thank my wife. She's been with me all along. Um, she's, she's been the one who's, who's took care of the house and let me do all I had to do to, to try and become as, as best a footballer as I possibly could. So thank you very much, Don. And I can't forget these two little beauties standing down here. Um, these two are my life, and they're so excited to be here on the pitch today. So um, they gave me a bit of stick if I don't do enough skills or if I run too slow or if we don't win. They're my big, biggest critics, these two, but I love them loads and they're my biggest supporters. So thank you, used to. I'd like to thank all the All-Stars. Um, it's a huge effort from, from all the players, and of course, Harry. Uh, Harry gave him a chance as a, as a, as a 17, 18 year old kid at West Ham with, with a team of Frank Lampard, Joe Cole, Rio Fernando already in it, and not many managers would do that. Well, I can think of one, maybe, but um, there's, there's, there's not many managers in the game that would do that um, at such a level, so cheers, Harry. So a huge thanks to all the players. Cheers, boys. I know you've all made a big effort to get here. Um, a few last-minute dashes in traffic and stuff, but I appreciate it. You know, I've had a great, I've had a great time playing against you over the years. So hopefully we'll have a good day today. Cheers, boys. And lastly, lastly, I'd like to to thank the players. Um, what a bunch of players we got here today. The um, you know, it's incredible, the turnout from them. I think, I think what, what makes this sponge so great is we're obviously a hugely talented group of players, and, um, but the, the togetherness, the spirit, the, the attitude, uh, how hard we work for each other, and uh, we certainly got our rewards for that, and it's a special group and special memories, so I'm just delighted that we, obviously we all can't be here today, but most of us are here, and, and I thank the boys for making the effort to come in. And lastly, lastly, I'd like, well, I'd like to thank Manchester United in general, the board of directors, the owners, because giving me this opportunity to, to put the game on. And I'd also like to, to leave the, the final thank you to Sir Alex, the man that brought me to the club. If it wasn't for this man, I wouldn't be here today. We all know how great he is and what he's achieved at this club. But if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be here today. And he's taught me so much. He's, I've learned so much off him. Um, he's been inspirational and a massive influence on my career. So thanks very much, boss. <laughs> right, that's all from me now. You've heard me talking far too much. I'd just like to say, We've got a lot of the old players here today. I'd love to hear the old songs, so I want to hear we all singing the old songs, all the classics. We all love a good sing song. So I want you to sing as much as you can today because it's a, a very unique opportunity to have this group of players back together. So enjoy the day and thank you very much. Michael Carrick, a class act on and off the field. And he's put together a couple of very, very 
good sides for the uh, the entertainment of the massed crowd here at Old Trafford. Let's have a look at the Manchester United side. A couple of all-time greats in that. Giggs and Scholes, great to see them together again. One of the most formidable centre-back partnerships ever for this club, Ferdinand and Vidic. Of course, current players, Carrick and Rooney. Sir Alex Ferguson back in the dugout. Eight of that team Ladies started in Moscow in 2008. The All-Star team. Well, they like a number 10 in the All-Star team. Three of them are number 10, <laughs> um, including former Red Michael Owen. He starts and four times Champions League winner Clarence Sadoff in midfield. And a couple of the Premier League's best ever defenders, John Terry, Jamie Carragher, Phil Neville amongst the subs, Harry Redknapp, the manager of the All-Star side. There's the squad. And great to see Sir Alex Ferguson back as the manager at Old Trafford, four years after he was last in the dugout for that game against Swansea. It is less than a fortnight since the appalling events in the Manchester Arena. So many lives changed forever. And before we kick off here, Old Trafford is going to pay its tribute to the victims of that attack and for the awful terrorist attack in London just last night. And the teams are going to come together around the centre circle. Reeds are going to be laid in the centre circle as well. And all of the mascots are going to hold a single rose as well. Devastating moments that we've played the lives of innocent people. The city of Manchester United coming together to support all the victims in this attack, and today we show our strength once again. Please observe the minute silence as we remember those who were tragically taken in Manchester two weeks ago and last night in London. The silence will begin and end on the referee's whistle. But it's unusual for a minute silence to make the hairs on the back of your neck stand on end. That one did. Football club, and of course the mascots were holding their roles. The memory of those that we'd like to see Michael Carrick and his kids, Louise, JC, never ever going to forget this day. Neither will the the Carrick family. And we're all set for what should be a hugely entertaining afternoon. Manchester United's 2008 vintage against the Michael Carrick. All stars. There's a lot of great players in that all star lineup. As the reeves that were laid by Sir Alex and Michael Carrick taken off the field. Our referee experienced Premier League official Neil Smallbrick is going to be in charge of this game. It's a packed Old Trafford. Great to see. Michael Owen. Wayne Rooney and uh, Ryan Giggs standing over the ball inside this centre circle. So many players that you, you thought you never were going to see again at Old Trafford. We get a chance to do it today. And one last chance for Old Trafford to boo Jamie Carragher and John Terry, which is <laughs> just pantomime booing, that's all it is. It's Neil Swarbrick has a look at his watch. We're off a little bit later than advertised, but we're looking forward to it. Underway then for the Michael Carrick 
testimonial match, the Manchester United 2008-11 against the Michael Carrick All-Stars. And great, first of all, to see Patrice Evra back in red. I mean, this back four amongst the best we've ever seen at this football club. Paddy Crown alongside me up on the commentary gantry here at Old Trafford. And wonderful, Paddy, to see some of these players back together again. The dreadful thing about it, Stuart, is you grow old, don't you? I mean, what a back four, back five tonight they've got out there. I know that Paul Scholes in the middle of the park, but what a defensive line. All European Cup winners. Fletcher to Wayne Rooney. And Giggs gets it over to <laughs> Jason Park. Park's Can't great friend Evra in towards Giggs with a shot on goal already, and that's a corner. I'm just laughing, shit, because Canningham had a right goal at Wayne Rooney from the, from the first tackle. Wayne went down and looked up at him. No friendly between United and Robert Pallister. Ryan Giggs will take. The corner, United's record clearance maker and a giant in the history of our club. In towards Brown, it drops towards goal and uh, Shea Gibbon will just flop on that. Wes Brown, who of course was on the bench for United, played Blackburn this season in the, the FA Cup. Played it right back in that uh, Champions League final of 2008. Dross for Ronaldo to score. Yeah, you don't realise what a terrific player he was as well. Not only could he defend, he could play as well. There was booing for John Terry being near the ball. It didn't even <laughs> touch the ball. But it's good-natured. It's pantomime. I think John realises that. When you think John is a Kinsey United fan, sure. That's amazing, that, isn't it? The reason I found out about that was I met his father in Moscow at the final the night before the game, and he told me. Well, you could argue John Terry should be in the Manchester United 2008 side because... Uh, it was his slip that led to us winning the European <laughs> Cup. <laughs> Carragher. Oops. Giving away to Giggs. He's got Rooney up with him. Fletcher to the right. It plays in Rooney. Maybe a first opportunity back to Giggs. Now scores. Park onto it quickly to Michael Carrick. You're just thinking there, Stuart. Why didn't somebody hit it? <laughs> well, you, you thought Paul might. Yeah. Duff, who in his day was an absolute flying machine, was a great success with Jose Mourinho at Chelsea. Well, there was a lot of talk about him when he was at Blackburn in the United Stuart, strangely enough. Duff and Robin, it's terrific. Thrashed up towards Robbie Keane, but Vidic is there. Vidic to Ferdinand. How many times did we say that over the years? One of the truly great centre back partnerships in the history of our club and the Premier well, League. Without, without question, I've been arguing about that. Robbie Keane. Salgado, who would have been absolutely delighted by Real Madrid's success last night to midfield. Marcus Senna, who was literally united plenty of times in his days at Villarreal. Really effective defensive midfield player. Save off, always tried something pretty clever there, but Vidic will nod it back to Edwin van der Zaar who is uh, Edwin today, is the oldest player on the field at 46, but he still looks as fit as a butcher's dog. Carragher got it back <laughs> to Shea Given. He's taking some stick, John, isn't he? But in the nicest possible way. <laughs> <laughs> Salgado, 10 seasons at Real Madrid, a couple of Champions Leagues. You make that sound as if it was nothing, a couple of Champions Leagues, as if it was nothing. Well, they win it every year now, don't they, Real Madrid? Yeah. That's the standard. Just, oh, well oh. brought down. Wonderful from Damien Duff. He's bound in tight. 38 now, Damien Duff. Wes is closing in on that, 37. Seidorf, wonderfully gifted oh, midfielder. Great player as well, Stuart. I mean... When you look at some of the players that are out there, absolutely great players in their, their time to come here and play the testimonial match. Four-time Champions League winner. Well, he was a bit used for Rio Ferdinand, wasn't he? As day three will tell you. Well, I'm hoping it's somewhere in the contract that Sir Alex Ferguson has to get the hairdryer out at least once today. It is a testimonial. <laughs> well, he may. hopefully he'll do that. We'll get a great reaction from the crowd if he does. Should have told them before they started the game. His goals. 
to Carrick. Another great partnership in midfield. Carrick and Scholes have worked a treat for United. And Carrick still going strong. Park. Remember Sir Alex saying how painful it was for him to leave Park out of the Moscow squad. Such an effective player for United. Brown. Darren Fletcher, we have to say Darren Fletcher of Stoke City now, joining Stoke from West Brom. Oh, he's a terrific player for us and he's been a great pro, Stuart. Scholes, shoot, they say. <laughs> he's about 45 yards out. He's just over the halfway line. There's got to be a chance that Paul Scholes will get a yellow card today. Well, well done. Abadal. Yeah, it just shows you the courage of the lad, doesn't it? Come back and play again. Salgado, love to get forward from right back, but that cross just drifts behind for the goal kick. Salgado, who actually ended his career, you might remember at Blackburn, three seasons at, at Blackburn. Right, right, right. Well, the cross there, he probably thinks he was still playing at Blackburn or Real Madrid when he put it in so early. They're all a bit older, these players now. So Harry there, back in front line management. Thought he, he was finished, but back at Birmingham, kept them up. Signed a contract for a year, so uh, even at the age of 70, still hungry. And he's got that bit of magic, hasn't he? Right here. Now Wayne Rooney. Took a deflection towards right, Fletcher. Right, right. Abidal, right, that's right. cool. Oh, that's cool, right. under severe pressure. Abidal, you might remember, lifted the Champions League trophy against United at Wembley in 2011. He wasn't the captain, but the captain said, now you lift it, because he'd made an incredible recovery after a tumour in his liver. Just takes a slight deflection that, but that's coolness for you, Abidal. Everett playing his try at Marseille now, and he's won a corner. Rooney goes across to take it. Manu Vidic is trundling into the box. He goes as well, wins the header, it drops for Brown. Cross goal, and fly hacked clear by Salgado. There's a little shove there yeah. by Robbie Keane on Park. And now it's a nice touch to Carrick. He's got Giggs with him. Giggs. Oh, that wasn't what he intended, the pass back to the goal, he was trying to put that across the goal. Terrific pass. It tries to play this across the goal, but it doesn't come off. Everyone wondering what Ryan Giggs' next move is going to be in terms of management. Obviously, he was the assistant here to Louis van Gaal. And linked with the Sunderland job. I think he's linked with every job, actually. Oh, Ryan well, Giggs. Close season, isn't it? Duff against Wes Brown. Keane. Keane got it through to Michael Owen. He just couldn't make the... Space for himself. Old age, sure. <laughs> well, <they'll let> you. <laughs> Not old age, but age. Coming from you, Paddy, that's frightening. I know, but I'm just thinking if that was 20 years ago, it would have been on the end of it, probably. Park. Just a blur of energy, Jason Park, and he still is, by the looks of things. Park, well, he was looking to lay it to skulls, but John Terry read it, and it's up to Robbie Keane, who had five or six very successful years at LA Galaxy. Now Duff, just waiting for support, it's slow, to say the least. It's, it's glacial for the support, but here's Keane. Well, Sadoff, just got it caught under his feet there. Yes, and two touches when one would have done. The second touch should have been a shot. Sadoff, who's won the Champions League with three different clubs, the only man to do that, Ajax, Real Madrid and Milan. He had a really gilded career. Salgado. Into Senna. John Terry. I wonder what his next move is going to be after leaving Chelsea. 717 appearances for Chelsea. Well, that's the sad thing about football, Stuart. It comes to an end. No matter how good you are. Giggs. Park. Couldn't quite find Rooney. Fairness, Jamie Carragher read that very well. 
He did, he did exceptionally well there, he had to. Everybody was away. Imagine he's one of those players, Jamie Carragher, who loves to be booed. <laughs> and relishes <laughs> being booed. I think sometimes, Stuart, when you boo players, when, it, when it's actually real live games, it boosts the player. Of course, Stephen Gerrard and Frank Lampard were originally in this side, both picked up injuries, but if they would have been playing, all you would have heard was boos for the entire game. Great players. I know, but that's respect, Stuart. Well, you tend to boo players that are slightly of scared of, though, yeah. Of course. Avidal. Here's Duff. Sadov, here's Carragher. One club man, Jamie Carragher, 737 appearances for Liverpool, extraordinary record. You know the funny thing about it, Stuart, you know he was an Everton fan. He was as a kid, yeah. He was a kid, 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 he yeah, he's 41 now, Michel Salgado. Here's Carrick. Takes a bit longer to get back when you reach 41. <laughs> Michel Salgado. Fletcher. Fletcher, who was two and a half years at West Brom, did not miss a league game. Can you consider the terrible health problems he had towards the end of his United career? What a record of fitness. Oh, terrific first shot. Everett. It's a good run, he's still going, he might go all the way, Everett. Oh, he's gone down. <laughs> Neil Swarbrick thinks about it. Besides, there was no foul. John Terry gets away from the scene of the crime very quickly. I'm not so sure that was a penalty shoot. It was a great run by him. Same. Terry. Same off to Duff. He ended his career at Shamrock Rovers. Duff with a bit of coaching there. Sadov, Senna, worked it well to Eric Abadar. Sadov, one of those players, Sadov, who makes football look very, doesn't very he? easy. Doesn't he? Well, he passed that there. So easy. Oh, but great players can do that. Carrigan. Scholes, another player who makes it all look very, very straightforward, doesn't it? Giggs. Oh, he sees Wayne, he sees Wayne. Oh, was that handball from Carragher? I think I have more than anything, so he could go out the road of it. But it was looking for Wayne, Ryan. Ryan Sullivan about the referee. No? Evra, Ferdinand. Of course, he was in uh, Cardiff last night. Ray Ferdinand, a number of these players were actually in Cardiff last night. Skulls, he's looking for Rooney, what a pass, Rooney onto it, can he finish? He's tried the chip, oh. it's landed on top of the net, but that was a trademark Paul Skulls pass. Class is permanent, oh, that's a great Paul Skulls. When you think this, many times you see passes like that, Stuart, very rarely. He's onside as well, Wayne, it's just a pity it didn't finish up the back of the net, it's just a heavy touch on it, but what a ball. Shows you what we missed when he left, doesn't it? When he finished. Paul Scholes. Truly one of the greats. Only Ryan Giggs and Sir Bobby played more often for United than the great Scholes. You named them the great Scholes and they're great. Not many better midfield players than him. Here's Senna. Across to Abadal. Duff, Seidorf, Fletcher in the way, everything going through Seidorf though in the All-Stars uh, midfield, Carrick, his brother, Graham is on the bench for United, that would be a great move, I wonder <laughs> if it will be Carrick coming on for Carrick. Ah, no, you've got them, they've got the two of them putting together surely, David, David Beckham done it with his son. Oh, another chance. Oh, I thought he was going to get the end of that part. Go on, kick. Jeez, 36 Gs. Retired quite quite early in terms of age. Diggs 
Ron Giggs to take the corner. Ron Giggs just getting ovation simply for taking a corner. <laughs> Quite no, right, no, too. Stuart, that's for 20 odd years. Giggs always, always trying to play in skulls for that Bradford City style volley, but <laughs> didn't quite get it right. Uh, it was just too far out. Nice header, very adroit header from skulls there. Skulls and Sadorf in their pomp. How much money were they? Oh, with? dear me. Just unfortunate Wayne didn't get that through there. Patrice Embra doing at the edge of the 18 yard line <laughs> now. Long looking for Robbie Keane, but Ferdinand. I mean, Ferdinand and Vidic just knew exactly where each other were in that wonderful perfect, partnership. Perfectly away from each other, weren't they? Fletcher. wide to Everett, loves getting forward from left back, it's a powerful run but Salgado gets his body in the way, oh it's not going to hurt either, <laughs> how did that stay in? Well he did well there Salgado to match Patrice Everett for running, the long will keep it up straight if the runs like that. Space here for Eric Abadal to run onto to Robbie Keane. Keane inside the box now. Oh, still Robbie Keane. He did well there. He wasn't a favourite. He was submerged by red shirts. He still got the shot off. And Sadov. Duff to Abadal. Duff. Go back to John Terry. <laughs> Handball, surely. <laughs> I don't hit the pillow because of the handball. <laughs> Mendieta. Wonderfully gifted player. It's Pete Mendieta. Was that, was it? Ended his career at Middlesbrough, you remember, but uh, Valencia was when he really made his name. Terry. Senna. Terry's continued his run. He's worked it well. And that shot by Mendieta, who I was just praising for being so gifted. <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> Shanks wide. I don't think his left foot was his best. A good bit of football all the same. John Terry wanting to get in the act up there, hoping he'll get it back. But you're not getting it back, John. Not going to have a shot. Mendieta, who with Ryan Giggs is the oldest of the outfield players at 43. Brad, Fletcher. Michael Carrick signing that new deal, which means he's going to have a 12th season next year. Still a top class player, Stuart. Ever. John Terry. He used to sing that over the years like a dominant header. Oh, brilliant. Oh, wonderful. Oh, so terrific. Oh, and, uh, well, everybody applauding that inside Old Trafford. Glorious little give and go from Clarence Sadoff. He still looks very fit, doesn't he? Look at him, he's so strongly built. Yeah. Looks very fit still. I'll bet he's the type of lad that looks hard. I bet he's in the gym every day, Stuart. Yeah. Watch this bit of skill here. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. Thank you, darling. <laughs> <laughs> he did have a short spell managing Milan. Clarence Sadoff and managed in China as well. I think he's looking for a managerial job, ideally perhaps in the Premier League. Mind you, the way he started this game, I just wonder if he can still play. play. You're right. Vidic on Mendieta. Mendieta didn't like it too much. And now here's Giggs. A bit of space, looking for Rooney through the middle. Oh, the hand ball in that, was it? Safely pouched by Shea Given. Just save was crowded out, Stu. I think it would be proper game would be given a free kick. I'm not sure Wayne really does friendlies. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Can't get far wrong either. Scholes. Drops from Michael Carrick to Park. Scholes. Fletcher. Carrick again. Three to aim at in the centre, but that's class, I think, from Terry. He just chested it back <laughs> to give it. I wonder how often he's played with Shea Gibbon. I don't think he ever has, has he? And it's all got the confidence, both of them. This is terrific defending that, that's confidence for you. John Terry, of course, his career at Chelsea ended with that, um, that guard of honour after 26 minutes of his final appearance against Sunderland. Hopefully we won't be doing that in five minutes' time. What a player. Oh, that's a great ball. What a pass to Aberdell. It's away from Brown. Duff waits in the centre. Oh, what a great chance. Mendieta, side foot's in, wonderful finish, guided it home, and the Michael Carrick all-star sides strike first here at Old Trafford. It's the United side of 2008-0, the all-stars won. Well, it's a great bit, bit of work by Mendieta, isn't it? It's so cool, shit. he's not offside, no question about the offside, that's a great ball down the flank. But this is good play, Stuart, this is intelligent play, this. <laughs> He's lost control there for a second, but I'll just play it back and somebody will be there. There was someone there. It was thank you very much, back of the net. Of course, he just doesn't control it for a bit. Nice little touch back, and look at that big gap that's there. He just passes it home. Yeah, he? that's all he does. And the goalkeeper can't see a thing. Well, to be fair, Stuart, in games like this, people like to see plenty of goals when they come. I remember Mendieta getting a couple against United for Middlesbrough a few years ago. Ram's done well there. A free kick. You can hear a pin drop when that ball hit the net as well. <laughs> Mendieta scores the crowd demanding a shot, but no. Park. Scores. <laughs> Come on, Paul, give us what we want. <laughs> he didn't have the room there, Stuart. Here's Giggs. <laughs> Tried to clip one across, but the uh, deflection was kind, and now... Oh, dear. It's quite a virtuoso first 20 minutes or so from that fine, fine player, Clarence Sadoff. Here he is again. <laughs> gets taken out by Giggs, who's not having any of it. Well, to be fair to him, sure, I think he was looking for Abidal as well. He's trying to flick the ball to him. Well, you watch this, he tries to flick the ball to Abidal. And he gets taken out because of it. Terrific <laughs> 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 bad skill, wasn't it? <laughs> So far, he looks just about the best best player on the pitch, doesn't it, Seydorf? He's controlling things. Skulls, a bit of space for him. So clever at finding space. Look at that, from a pass. A full pass to Everett. He can take it in his stride. He's got Rooney with a header. It's a good opportunity. Never caught it properly, really. He'd like to get a bit more beef in that. A bit of a glance and header more than anything. He looks as fit as Anderson, Patrice Everett, doesn't he? Dear me. Just doesn't get enough on it. Maybe had a little bit more space than, than he thought. Than he probably thought. He was trying to pull and it was not connected properly. The Paul Scholes tackle a second ago. Every time you see this man, it's a treat. <laughs> I didn't touch him, ref, that's what you're saying. No, you didn't, Paul, of course you didn't, you never ever did. Well, of course, the, the two men retired at the same time in 2013, Sir Alex and Paul Scholes. Good to see Mickey feeling alongside um, Sir Alex there as well, Albert the kit man. He's aging well, Albert, isn't he? He looks very, very smart. So it's the All-Stars who are leading here, Mendieta. 
with the goal. Park, Rob's duff. Many times have you said that with Park, Rob and Sunday? Over the years, I mean, it's, it's done it time and time again. It just didn't quite happen for him when he left United. He went to QPR and didn't work and ended on loan to PSV. I think United sent him straight. He's had a habit of scoring in the big games, didn't he? I think five against Arsenal. Jason Park. Fletcher striding forward then for United. Carrick. Rooney. Park. And nuisance from himself again. Evra. Here's Giggs. In towards Fletcher, but it's John Terry who is so adept makes it look, front, makes it look easy doesn't it right place <laughs> right time his positioning yeah spot on makes it look easy still think he could do a really good job for somebody in the Premier League good oh. lord what's he doing there <laughs> <laughs> some run John Terry sprightly at 36 John Terry Senna who ended his career at the uh, New York Cosmos Last side, Duff. Owen just plays it back up the line. Number ten to number ten. Senna. Oh, asking a lot. Nice brand guides that back to Edwin van der Sar. <laughs> the only thing Edwin van der Sar has had to do in this game is pick the ball out of the net. It's good to see Edwin in Stockholm last week. Part of the uh, the hierarchy at Ajax now. Evra. The bit of support line. Evra. Oh, he's done well to go back to this. It's a battle down there between those two, isn't it? Saldado felt he was fouled by Ryan Giggs. Yeah. He's not happy with it, is he? I'm not playing a friend. Huh? Corner then, United looking for the equaliser. Thought it's been an entertaining start to this game. Oh, Apple header! 1 1. Nemanja Vidic. That is classic Vidic. Up from the back, and he plants that header into the corner, and United are level with the All Stars at 1 1. Well, you always think that about the ball from the, the box, and corners are free kicks. Nemanja Vidic. He's so brave, Stuart. He'll put his head anywhere, won't he? If he's got a chance to put the ball in the back of the net. And you come through a crowd of players there. Manchester United 2018. Number 15, Nemanja Village. Crowd enjoyed that. Oh, powerful header. Is it his head, Stuart? Yes, it is. Nemanja, 300 appearances for United, 21 goals. He was a threat. Oh, he was a set great, pieces. great defender, Stuart. One thing about him was, was his defending, he was fantastic at that. Entertaining fair here on Michael Carrick's big day. 1-1, one, one, here's Rooney finding a bit of space. Gone for goal himself. Uh, given his down to collect to his near post. Yeah, I tried to sell him a dummy there, I think he was aiming for the far post. And he went to the near one. Well, she's looking as he's going to play this into the far post and he changes his mind. Reads it well given. Shane Given, who ended the season with, uh, with Stoke. 41 now, uh, Shane Given. Everett, who looks super fit, but then he should be. He's playing for Marseille. It's not like he's retired. Does look, still looks as sharp as anything, doesn't he? Well, the highlight of any week is what Patrice Everett is going to put on his Instagram feed. She always cheers you up. He loves this game. Do you want me to explain to you what Instagram is, buddy? I'm not answering that, Stuart, sure, because I haven't a clue what Instagram is. <laughs> what is it? I'll talk to you about it half time. King Abadal. Pass is excellent, John Terry, isn't it, for a central yeah. defender? Either foot. Nice and sharp. Always been like that. So the head of Keane and uh, Wes Brown can just guide that back to Edwin van der Zaar, whose final appearance for United was in the final in 2011. Skulls. 
Gates. Looking for Rooney through the middle. Carragher with Rooney. <laughs> Oh, sorry, it went out that, it went out that. The crowd enjoyed that, didn't they? The clash between Wayne and Carragher, but it just goes over the dead ball line. A bit of pushing and tugging going on between the two of them. Yeah, yeah. Can you, you keep the impression Wayne is deadly serious about this game, don't you? <laughs> he was desperate to keep that in. Oh, he's unfortunate there, isn't he? Oh. Warm afternoon now. And I'll try. I've had a bit of rain this morning, but great conditions here for this testimonial. Abadal continues his run from left back. The cross comes Brown to shut the door. He got the ball. Yes, he did. No complaints from Abadal. I think it was on his wrong side anyway. Abadal was going to have to throw his right foot at him. Scores. <laughs> <laughs> Sat nav pass from Scholes to Park. Here's Rooney. Dinks it to Everett. One, two. Scholes goes in again. Rooney. Everett. Dinks it in towards Fletcher. Oh, just a little bit too much. He's done well there, Duff. Side off. Didn't want to use the goalkeeper, great ball. He didn't exactly panic there, did he? No, I didn't Seidorf. not. Two against two, Owen. Mendieta. He gave the All-Stars the lead, but Emmanuel Vidic powering home an equaliser for United. Robbie Keane. Mendieta, Marcus Senna. The key. The key. He did great at LA Galaxy. 165 appearances for LA and 104 goals. Mendieta. Seidorf's touch and uh, well, had a lot of possession there, the All Stars, but in the end, couldn't quite make anything of it. change for the uh, All-Stars coming up. So three players getting a breather. That's lovely for us, isn't it? Throughout the game, there's going to be rolling subs. Six subs apiece on the bench today. So we'll just look at these changes. And you can see there's Phil Neville's going to be coming on. Ida and Johnson is going to be coming on as well. Heidegger Johnson, who was playing in the Euros a year ago for Iceland, so he's still uh, still fit. And Cap de Villa, who was a really good left back for Spain. So that's three changes. Last ten minutes of uh, the first half of this game. Worth remembering the Michael Carrick Foundation. It's going to 
use the proceeds of this game to fund community projects, both here in Manchester and in Newcastle as well. Well, that's his home, Newcastle, wasn't it? Focusing mostly on, on kids, giving them a, a safe place to play and learn. And Michael, I think, feels that, you know, at, at Wolves End Boys Club, he had that when he was growing up. Manchester United Foundation also benefiting from today. And really, that's what it's all about. Boston applauses. Is that Louis Sahan? Pemitov. Yes. United squad players today. Berber and Louis Saha warming up. I'll see them later. Giggs. Scholes. Carrick across to. Brian Giggs. Ever was lurking. <laughs> Who heard us that way? Who do you expect? John Taylor. Captivia. Full level. Looks for good Johnson, but Vidic in the way. <laughs> he was going to pass it to Gary Bevel, that's why the crowd laughed. <laughs> Gary's warming up. <laughs> well, he certainly talks a good game these days, Gary. Let's see uh, <laughs> see what he's like there. Oh, he's done it in the pitch before, so he doesn't have to do it anymore. <laughs> Fletcher. Park. Three on two here. He's got good Johnson up with it. Oh, if he sees the far post. Oh dear me. <laughs> Not much doubt about that. <laughs> that wasn't, yeah. You've got a good possession because you're actually here, but no, you're not getting past. <laughs> I mean, it's amazing that it's much of this, how friendly players are to each other, whereas the seniors might be fighting each other. Terrific career. Good Johnson's still going, effectively. That free kick then for all the All Stars. Look at the score again before half time, but easy enough for Evan Van der Zaar. And he gets United moving quickly. Scholes. Carrick. Helps it to Wes Brown. A little bit of space here at the right hand side, Wes. Gigs always available. Good <laughs> <laughs> love that little bit of skill there, didn't they? <laughs> From Ryan Gig. And now here's Rooney. Skulls. Oh, lovely pass. Gigs was coming onto it. On the outside of his right foot, but. It's a corner. It's Cap de Vier. Struggle to keep that in. Just watch this from yeah, the bro, master. Brilliant, but a skill there. <laughs> <laughs> Terrific. I hope all the young kids are watching this. Rio Ferdinand running forward to uh, collect the short corner. To Gates. He was looking to play it into Brown. One back by Carrick. Oh, he's gone for the chip, Carrick. Well, that was the fairy tale story, wasn't it, from Michael Carrick? I'll tell you something, she had been trying desperate to get a hand to it, but fortunately for him, it was over the bar. Watch the goalkeeper here, Stuart. Watch the goalkeeper. Oh, desperate to get a touch. We were right behind this. It was a wonderful effort. Mm -hmm. Michael Carrick. 459 appearances for United, 17th on the all-time list and more to come. Free kick that. One one. Carrick's parents are very, very proud. Michael enjoying himself today. I'm sure his kids. Still got, his wife to, here. still got a bit to do yet here at Old Trafford. Yeah, 
draw again. But uh, this time that's that's cut out. And Terry striding forward to Idegger Johnson. Bolton, Chelsea, and Barcelona, and many other clubs in the end of his career. The Johnson. Giggs. Carrick. Last five minutes of uh, an interesting first half here. Fletcher. Good day, not a team, which is true. That's what the club loves. Love to see a bit of entertainment. Late right corner for United. Well, the man of Vidic has thumped home the header once. And Leo Ferdinand coming forward now to Genevieve have a go. The man is back on halfway. Carrick. Fletcher. Scores. Scores with the effort. That was travelling. It's an awkward ball put back to ball the same, but he's made the best of it. Not far away. Great effort. Well, this is the, the, the 2008 game, if you like, and you go back to that 2008 Champions League semi-final against Barcelona, where from somewhere like that, just about yeah. that spot, actually, he put one into the top corner. What a player, what a player. 155 goals for United, 718 appearances. Now, Park, can he make space for the shot? Not quite, close down quickly in the end. Mm, great bit of skill by Wayne Rooney, oh, obviously. <laughs> A pull on Good Johnson there. You don't have many yellow cards today, do you? It's good defending this again, isn't it? So cool. Salgado. All the, all these players in their in their late thirties, early forties, they will. Be desperate for half time, I think. <laughs> Cap de Villa, World Cup, and European Championship winner with Spain. Good Johnson. Seidorf. Oh, done it again. Seidorf. Oh, brilliant skill. And then the effort towards goal was well blocked by Van der Zaar. Did very well there. It was good. Johnson struck it pretty well, but Van der Zaar got down, kept it out. Good Johnson getting it on target, keeping it low. Seidorf again lighting up on traffic. It was a brilliant start. Oh, terrific, isn't it? <clears throat> Don't need to say who's got the ball, just hear the boos. There's <laughs> <laughs> off. A late flag. I was well off. Cap de Villa. So Edwin making his first real save actually of the of the game. It was a good move. I mean, just watch Sadov. Watch this fellow. Oh, up there. terrific skill, that isn't it? Look at that little dummy there as well. Jason Pat. Great little dummy. Is he not all saved there, Luke? Johnson getting hold of it. That drops for Park, meanwhile. Oh, he just didn't control it, Stuart. He just kept that close to his body, it was a chance. Johnson, great control. Saves. I'm sure he's actually misplaced the pass in the entire game. It looks to me he's fit enough to play the Premier League, Stuart. Playing five aside football at half time, which will be fun here. I'm sure JC will love that. Get the chance to play in his old man's footsteps in Old Trafford. And got to follow. Won the free kick there, Sable. There was three trying to stop him. Yeah. <laughs> Last few seconds of this first half, then there won't be any stoppage time. Nobody wants any stoppage time out there. Half time, entertaining fair. 
here at Old Trafford for the Michael Carrick testimony. Warmly applauded, 1-1, Mendieta giving the All-Stars the lead, passing the ball home, but Nemanja Vidic powering home the equaliser with a header from a corner just before the half-hour mark. Plenty to admire in that first 45 minutes, really enjoyable stuff, but at the interval, it's the United 2018 won, the Carrick All-Stars won.